Hey everybody, Chief Meteorologist Brad Petovich here. The good news, the worst of it's over for our area. Now, eastern North Carolina and parts of South Carolina, you still got a ways to go, but you could see all clear from severe, basically, in our viewing area west. But to the east, things are still pretty active. Let me show you where the storms are right now. We still have some pretty strong storms moving through Chesterfield County, the PD region. These are racing to the east. So if you're in eastern North Carolina, central North Carolina, the low country of South Carolina, heads up, this line is pushing your way. And trust me, if it does anything like it did in the western Carolinas, get ready for quite a bit of wind damage. This is probably the most extensive wind damage I've seen in quite some time. Just to show you, these are the damage reports we're just getting in. Um, and you could see they started in Tennessee and moved into the region. A lot of trees down and a lot of power outages. In fact, I think we're around uh, 200,000 power outages just in the Western Carolina. So significant outages with this. I'll just show you how many reports we have within that box. Um, 99 reports of wind damage or thunderstorm, wind gust, hail, two injuries so far. This is as of seven o'clock. So. Uh, the good news, severe clear, or clear from severe to the west, but to the east, unfortunately, storm's still ongoing, so be safe in the eastern part of the state. We'll have a recap tonight at 11. I'll post any updates. Thank you for all the reports, videos, and pictures. They are very helpful. Hopefully, they help to warn people downstream and to the east. If you're watching this and you haven't been hit by the storms, go look at my feed, and you'll see all of those storms that are